Mr. Wolf, thank you for being with the Blue Radio. Uh, we would like to know which was the biggest challenge of publishing a book that wasn't properly liked by the President of the United States of America, Fire and Fury. Well, I think that there were a whole set of, 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 of challenges. Um, you, you know, it's um, daunting when the President of the United States tries to stop your book from being published. Um, it's daunting when his lawyers uh, threaten to sue you. Um, um, but I was fortunate enough to have a, a, a publisher who stood behind me and, and, um, and then fortunate enough to have millions of readers around the world. So um, I think we prevailed. You said that 2007 was the year where, when uh, print died. Can you explain that aff affirmation for us? You know, I think that that was the, just the, the moment. I mean, it came at the, um, um, just as the, um, the international fiscal crisis was, um, was, was hitting, um, that, um, that the, that, that the, that the essentially the, um, there, there came that moment of um, of that economic moment when I, I think pretty much everyone realized that there was going to be no recovery for the print industry, that advertising had um, um, that advertising had had left and was was not coming back, and that readers had left and they were not coming back. Okay, and you said also that writers were like the future to prevail those dreams alive in media, in television, in internet. What do you mean with that? The importance of write, of writers in this time where uh, media is like going so fast and television has the challenge to create good content to stay alive. Yeah, well, I, I think television is a writer's medium. Okay. Um, and. Um, um, good television is made by good writers, and um, um, uh, in television survives and thrives and grows uh, on the on the on, on the basis of good content, which is created by writers.